Well, hi and welcome back to the channel. Anyhow, it's uh, time for me to think about how I'm going to construct this theremin. So uh, while I'm waiting, I thought I might have one of my bread rolls. Now I'm on a bit of a diet, so uh, my bread rolls are not very big. But as you see, I've got them spaced out here on my breadboard so I can choose one that will taste really nice and set me up for the day. Now as I said I'm on a diet so uh, these are quite small and uh, if we zoom out I have a banana for scale. Now, those are so small, they're not worth eating, really, are they? But what can I do? What can I construct my theremin on? Oh, I know. I want to breadboard it on my breadboard. So there it is. My breadboard. And I don't think I'd better eat these bread rolls, do you? So anyway... Magically, two holes have appeared. Now these I've uh, carefully drilled through to 10 millimetres. And the forms of these, when I finally tune them just to fit in there, they will push into those holes, two of the coils, the other two being mounted on brackets at the ends. Now we're experimenting with trying to get this uh, ground plane done. So I've used some of this copper tape and uh, put it round the edge to give me a ground plane round the edge, which is similar to this one, um, to which a lot of the components will link. And... Uh, the plan is then to use uh, a point-to-point -point wiring, use the, maybe the component leads themselves to some extent, and uh, pieces of copper wire, an insulated wire for the longer bits, to uh, wire this together on that side. So uh, at the moment I'm experimenting with tinning this copper strip once it's stuck down to uh, basically to try and tin the whole of that I'm going to use uh, my hot air station um, now at the moment I think I set it to around about 300 yeah there we are 300 and I'll set the airflow in three. That's uh, out of a scale of eight, I think. I'm not sure. Anyway, I set on the airflow of three, temperature 300, and this one, this the one to the left of this, is the result using those settings. So the idea is not to get it too hot so that it uh, actually burns the wood just I'm doing slightly there when I try it on different settings but to get it hot enough to tin it reasonably quickly so uh, that's the next step is to try and tin around the edge of this ground plane to give it a bit more substance because this tape is very thin so uh, that would be a good basis then to uh, connect the components to. And there we have it. Tinned all the way round. Cleaned off with a bit of isopropyl. With the holes ready for those. Yep, 
the next step then is to put uh, components on. Sing the happy song together, and we'll all be a happy family. 